Mmm, it's an orange juice. What's up, everyone? It's OJ with my level one account. I'm technically still in Hog Mountain, even though I'm not there. 2982. So Hog Mountain is Arena 10, but so are my rural chests. Those are still Arena 10 rural chests. So I could still get a ghost in there. What I what I really need is a ghost and a log. That would really complete this account. Maybe a night witch in some circumstances, but I really need that ghost. I need that ghost so badly, I'm willing to open 20 of these chests. But before we open these chests, I want to thank our sponsors Moot for making this possible. Moot is an app that you can download on iOS, Android, or even find on your PC. You can stay updated on the latest trends, reviews, highlights, memes, or anything on any of these lounges. There are lots of lounges right now. The, the one that's featured is PUBG, but they have all of these other ones. Minecraft, Monster Hunter Destiny, Overwatch, Pokemon League of Legends, Fortnite, Call of Duty, Rainbow Six, board games, and of course, Clash Royale. So with all these posts, you can actually upvote or downvote them if you like them or if you don't like them. There's a leveling system too. I'm, lo I'm a level one moody right now, but you do get experience points for voting, sharing, or discussing your favorite game. Did you get the 12 and legendary challenge? I totes did. Boom. I'm gonna upvote myself because that's the kind of person I am. Look at that, my bar moved up. So you can navigate through all these lounges to see what's new and what's trending in the community. I'm gonna go into general. Oh, you have deck builder too, that's pretty interesting. He's got this all legendary deck. I need the Night Witch and I need the log and I need the ghost for that. So there are many more lounges to come. Big shout out to Moot for sponsoring this video, making it possible. We're gonna be opening 20 of these. Let's see what we need again, just a quick refresher. Just from that last post, I need all three of these apparently to get that legendary deck. So I need the log, I need the royal ghost, and I need the night witch. I'm hoping to just get a royal ghost, man. Okay, I don't really care about any of these ones. We're gonna blast through them. Nope, nope, I don't care. There we go. I don't need those. Alright. Level 2 graveyard. Blast through these really quickly, and what is the legendary gonna be? Night Witch! Oh, I love this new new chest. You can actually choose what you want in them. That's amazing. Okay, blast through everything really quickly again. This is our third chest opening, and now I just need the roll ghost or the log. The, the odds of that are really good, especially because you can pick any of them. So just to balance it out, I'm gonna go with the graveyard because I already had three lava hounds. Blasting through everything again really quickly. This is our fourth chest, and they're gonna be our fourth legendary. Another Night Witch. I just got her, man. I just got her. Okay, on to the fifth chest. I'm gonna pick everything on the left because I'm left-handed. Fun fact. I also like to play everything on the left side. Sparky, Lavon's? Lavon's coming quite a bit. Okay, I still need that log. I still need that Royal Ghost. We're on our sixth chest, I think. I've lost count, but we're gonna keep going until we run out of gems. He was. He's a handsome fella. We're gonna pick the Ewas. Go through these really quickly. Okay. Royal Ghost and the Log. Royal Ghost and the Log. You know, if I got the... Royal Ghost and the Log to pick from, I wouldn't even... I wouldn't even know what to do with myself. Okay. No ghost, no log. Just lots of ice wizards, lots of miners, lots of everything else. Roll ghost. L okay, roll ghost, that's what I'm talking about. I love these chests. They're so much easier than the than the previous chest openings when I had to deal with the super magicals. Because legendaries weren't guaranteed all the time. And now you get to pick one of the two legendaries. I'm gonna pick the bandit now that she's a clean, smooth level two. Okay, I need the log. I just need the log. I just need the log, the log, the log, 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 log. What a lumber, lumbery lumberjack. I really just need the log. The log is the only legendary I need. Also, I need this guy here. He's the wizard archer, magic archer, light archer, floating archer, who knows. 
And that one's gonna be a legendary based on the Supercell leak. I just need the log. The log is what is gonna complete my life. There we go. We got everything. We got every single legendary. Except we don't have the zappies. That's pretty sad. We didn't even need to go through all the gems. Alright. We're gonna build a beautiful deck. A beautiful, beautiful deck. Mmm. Mmm. I'm gonna put in the log instead of the ice wizard because or the electro wizard, because I don't I only used them for the zap. And then got the roll ghost. Oh yeah. That's nice. That is that is very nice. Do we need the bandit though? Do we really? Nope. This is a pretty wholesome deck. I love it. Let's let's try it out. He's level nine. I am level one. Skeletons. Don't die in one shot to my tower. This is just absurd. Alright, he's starting off with a Sparky. I don't have the Electro Wizard. This is really bad. Oh my goodness. That Sparky's gonna one shot my tower. Whew. Everything on this account is a negative elixir trade. You cannot afford any damage on anything. Oh no, that Ice Wizard. If you let that Ice Wizard fly, it's gonna deal like. 400 damage to my tower, and that's like 40% of my health, 30%, whatever. Okay, it's looking pretty decent right now. We're gonna slowly chip him away. I kind of miss my Ice Wizard. I'm freaked out that I don't have Zap for the Sparky right now. I'm a little freaked out. I'm a lot freaked out. And that, that Prince is gonna take it down to half. It's gonna take it out completely. Because I didn't have Skarmy. We've got the ghost though. How is he gonna deal with the ghost now? I really wish I had the ghost post nerf. Pre nerf. Okay. That ghost just wrecked that wizard. Night Witch connected to the tower. She's still at full health. Looking really healthy. Okay, the bat got some damage on. I've got the log this time. I love how I can deal with the princess. We're gonna let her scoot in a little bit closer. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love this. We're gonna deal some chip damage. I'm not gonna let the miner fly by deal anything. And he's not gonna let my my princess do anything. She's not gonna touch the tower at all. Ice wizard on ice wizard action. This is the battle of the century. Let's go in with that miner. I've got an inferno dragon for that Valkyrie. Oh, okay, I need to cycle to my Skarmy and away from that wizard. Yep, we've got the wizard targeting on the ice wizard. And that miner is actually going to take out my tower. It's actually going to take out my tower. That's a lot of damage. Okay, looking good. I love this account because it's like a baby on steroids. It's a little baby, a really buff baby. Predict the miner, okay. We're good, we're good. I haven't seen any spells from him yet. We're gonna go all in on the right side. We're going everything on the right side. Miner, Night Witch, Ghost, Inferno Dragon. Looks like he might, might have given up. Are we gonna get a three crown on this? And the Inferno Dragon goes in for the three crown. And that is how you get back to Legendary Arena. The dream is to get to 4,000 in Challenger, so I'll get this draft chest forever. That is the dream. I kind of like Sparky. We're putting her back in there. We're putting her back in there. I feel a little naked without my Ewiz, but I feel reassured that I can take it out, take out any princess with my the log. He's laughing. He's laughing because I'm a baby. A really buff baby. Fireball on the princess, 4 for a 3. Usually that doesn't make sense, but he just destroyed my tower. 
It's all negative elixir trades all day, all day long. We're gonna win with negative elixir trades, and that's how we're gonna do it. I don't have the Ewas, so we're gonna have to use the Scarmy. And those skeletons aren't gonna be enough to distract or for anything, so we're gonna have to use Inferno Dragon on that Inferno Dragon. Oh my goodness, Sparky, I love her! I should put Tornado in here, she is amazing! But look at that, one hit on the tower, and my tower is still at lower health. Let's try and get another fireball going on. Little happy princess in the back, if he fireballs that, he's not gonna fireball it, he's scared this time. He's scared. He's scared of this buff baby. Okay. Okay, I'm a little scared, that golem, that golem's gonna take everything out. Okay. Oh dear. Skarmy is gonna be enough, but is that death damage gonna hit my tower? If that death damage does, okay, it's gonna hit my tower. Boom. It's a lot of damage. He's got Inferno Dragon. But is Sparky gonna make it? Oh my goodness. No, she'll never make it. She'll never make it. I've gotta do Inferno Dragon on Inferno Dragon action. My Inferno Dragon's gonna live because I've got my Princess Tower. It barely lived. Because my Princess Tower doesn't even hurt it. It tickles everything. So I can't use my the log right now. I need to be more conservative. Don't want to make too many negative elixir trades. You want to make as little negative elixir trades as you can when you're playing on a level 1 account. Okay. He's got a witch. I'm going to have to commit 9 elixir for just the witch. Not a big deal. We're going to throw the log to send a message that we are going to win with massive negative elixir trades going on. Okay. He's got the minion horde. We're going to have to throw everything we have, including the princess. He used prediction fireball on that. My skeletons are, are like level 6 because they're epic. It's not enough. Uh, that witch is going to wreck me. Let's put a princess on the other side. That's a very scary wizard that's going to take out my tower in one hit. So, we're just going to go in with a roll ghost. At least that roll ghost can one-shot my skeletons. I've got that going for me. Sparky on the witch. Doesn't matter. We're gonna we're gonna make it happen. Oh, I love you, Sparky. It worked. Okay, he's go he's going fireball on the Sparky. We're gonna go in. We, we need that princess. Oh, Inferno. Okay. Okay. Whew. That. That Inferno Dragon would have taken up my tower. That minion horde on the right side would have wrecked me. He let my miner chip it out. I really like the Royal Ghost, but I really like Sparky even more. No, Tornado... Tornado is not going to take out skeletons like the Royal Ghost can. A level 1 Tornado ain't gonna do anything. We're gonna go again. Level 10 versus the level 1 baby on steroids. We'll start with an Ice Wizard in the back. It's a little bit slower. It's, it's not as sensitive as the Princess. The Princess is really sensitive. If you send in the log, she's gonna cry and everything and all that stuff. And we don't want any of that. We want everyone to be happy right now. So we're gonna have to counter that hog with massive, massive negative elixir trades. Okay. That baby dragon. That baby dragon needs to die. Yes. Oh, that is so much damage. We've got a princess going for us. I remember before I unlocked the princess or ice wizard, dealing with Skarmy was obnoxious. Even like in the 1000 range, anything Skarmy was just, it was painful, man. It was painful. Let's go in with a Sparky on the right side. And, uh,. A panic ghost on the left side. That mini P.E.K.K.A would have pretty much one-shot my tower. But he's got a level 2 princess. 
That is not. That is. That is. No. The log. The log has failed me. Uh oh, that's gonna be a lot of damage with the baby dragon connects. Whew. That was really close. I I didn't have the elixir for it. Now I don't have the elixir for the princess. Uh, those, those skeletons are gonna do a lot of damage. Okay. Look at that. That baby dragon destroyed my ice wizard and my tower just because my even though my ice wizard was tanking for the tower, that tower tickles the baby dragon. Is this gonna be our first loss? I just I can't completely stop that hog all the time. My Skarmy isn't enough. Ooh, that princess though. That princess. We're gonna send it in this time. He can't really take care of my royal ghost, but I can't take care of his anything. He has a P.E.K.K.A. Well, I've got an Infernal Dragon, son! Is that... It's enough. It's barely enough. We're going in. Everything. We're going all friggin' in. All in for everything. Royal Ghost, mine, he's got Minion Horde, he's got Skarmy, it's gonna stop everything. At least my the log kills the Skarmy. Alright. So we're gonna go Roll Ghost Miner on the right side. Roll Ghost, come on, Roll Ghost, Roll Ghost, Roll Ghost, Royal, Royal Ghost! Knock back that princess, I can't afford any damage right now. The Hog Rider, get out of here Hog Rider. Princess, let's throw down everything. Negative traits for Minion Horde. We got Princess, we have Ice Wizard, we got everything. Mini Pekka, I don't like it. It's too many negative elixir trades. I had to throw down six elixir for the minion horde. And I had nothing for that mini P.E.K.K.A. Well, I am still in Hog Mountain, so I hope you guys enjoyed the series. And let me know in the comments if you guys want to see a different combination of legendaries in the deck for next time. Maybe in a month, we'll revisit this account. But other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Hey.